It's really difficult to tell my story, but I also realize it can serve as an example of what exactly is at stake in this election. When I was 17, my dad got sick. He got the flu. It's not a huge deal when you get the flu, but it didn't go away. I tell him, like, you should go to the doctor. He was like, I can't, I can't, I can't afford it. I don't have insurance. He didn't have health insurance because he was laid off. His kidneys failed, had a heart attack. I feel like if he had health insurance, he would still be here. After that, my mom was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis. It was really hard on her because there was a lot of medical bills that went along with that, and she was getting worse and worse. It really hit me at some point that education can wait. School was put on the back burner. I moved in with her, and I worked at a grocery store, and I had to be strong. I had to be strong for her. She was my best friend. I remember thinking, like, what am I going to do when she's gone? When President Obama passed the Affordable Care Act, I realized he has taken real steps to make sure that people's mothers and fathers and sons and daughters are not dying because they don't have health insurance. That was the turning point for me. I wanted to make sure that the president was reelected and that the Affordable Care Act stays and that all of those millions of people will have health insurance. Every day I am calling people and sharing my story and if my story helps people understand what's at stake, then I will share it. I just want to do what I can to make the United States a better place and to protect what the president has accomplished. Thanks so much for all the great work you're doing. Thank you so much. Uh, really so proud of you. This election is too important to sit on the sidelines. That's what this election is about, our voice. Our story. Michelle's dad had MS, and so oh, really? yeah, you know, he passed away probably about a year after I was dating Michelle. But I, I saw you know, what families go through, and uh, that's part of the reason why healthcare reform is so important. I just want to say how, how much we appreciate everything you're doing. You know, Americans like Ryan are why I ran for this office in the first place and why I am running for it again.